okay so welcome to this new video in this video i will be uh, explaining how we can write on code in the arduino id to control the led on the board cell so this board is a uh, board mcu esp8266 model so today i'll just tell that how you can write a code to control the led on the chip uh, on this board itself uh, so as i have shown in the online video also that uh, what we simulation so we can control the internal LED, uh, internal LED. So here uh, the same program will write. First is a pin move so that to set the pin uh, inside the LED to as output. Uh, so here in this uh, uh, device node MCU pin number 16 is the input uh, inbuilt LED. So I am selecting 16 here for Arduino. You know it is uh, uh, pin number 30. Uh, again I will write here digital write. Digital write pin number 16 as high. So make sure you write the high in the capital. Then a delay to make it switch on for one second. So I'll write 1000 here and uh, colon after that again digital write pin number 16 as uh, low. So this will make the switch it will switch up the LED again one delay. And after delay 1000 millisecond, it is one second. So now the program is ready to blink on LED in the uh, ESP uh, ESP8266 model. So you can see the code writing the code is basically uh, same as of the Arduino here. Now I'll uh, uh, before uploading the code, you have to make sure that you have uh, selected the correct correct model here. So here I have selected this one node mcu 1.0 which is uh, uh, written uh, behind this uh, system behind, behind this module it is written there okay so i have selected that and then select the port so i have to first connect this device then only i can select the port okay so i have connected the device again i will go to port and you see to which port it is connected it automatically takes that uh, port okay after that you have to just upload this code means uh, click on this arrow button it will compile the code and it will try to upload okay so it's saying delay spelling is wrong so it will upload uh, compile the code and then it will upload it Okay, now it is uploading the code so you can see if it is visible uh, one small led is blinking here at the top and here is the inbuilt led which will be blinking shortly once uh, this is ready so code is now being uploaded and uh, okay 100 percent completed so after this you will see that this is now started blinking so we have written this code and uh, it is start, started blinking so uh, right now let let us just change this code a bit to change the uh, blinking pattern so i will make this as uh, 500 okay and just 500 and we will see that what change is happening in this uh, blinking pattern so now it is compiling the code and uh, after the compilation so here you can see this compilation completed and it is uploading the code now so while uploading the code you can see here one small LED is blinking which is uh, not visible uh, but it is blinking while uploading it happens and then once upload complete we will see that blinking pattern will change here okay now you can see the blinking pattern is changed so glow time is less and the uh, off time is high so uh, uh, like this you can uh, make different different blinking patterns so let's just copy this and i'll paste it here uh, again to change some pattern okay now uh, if i upload this let us see what pattern it happens so like this you can just think so it will fast blink fast then it will be slow okay so now it is compiling here once the compilation completed it will try to upload the code here 
uh, you can see once the code is uploaded and the blinking stop and the code is, get, uh, code is getting uploaded and here you can see one small LED is actually blinking okay in the after the code gets completely uploaded uh, then we will see that uh, the pattern what is the pattern coming so see here uh, two times it blinking uh, then one time it is blinking uh, at the linear, uh, linear time okay so this is how you can just uh, make your uh, program to control leds in the arduino and uh, further i'll try uh, to show you how you can use this uh, board for communicating serially with the arduino id software that is you can show some data in the serial monitor so that's it from this video and thank you